We'll guide you through how to read WhatsApp messages from another device. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This is really useful to be able to do as you don't have to have that device in order to read the messages. So in this case, these are the messages I want to read on another device. If you're using an Android, which you want to do this with, then you can actually have multiple accounts within the WhatsApp app. So therefore you can go and keep your main account and switch and go and read another account. But on an iPhone, you can only have one account. So therefore, if you want to read these messages on another iPhone, then what you need to do is only have that account. So during the setup phase, you need to click on agree and continue, then go to the top right where you enter your phone number and you can then click on link as companion device. But as I said, on an Android, you can do this with multiple and you can switch between them. So all you need to do is come to chats, go to the top right and click on the three dots and click on settings. Then what you need to do is go to the top right here and click on the plus and we can actually go and add another account. So come to the bottom and click on add account. Go to the top right and click on the three dots and click on link as companion device. Come to the device you want to read the messages from and come to settings. On an iPhone, it's the bottom right. On an Android, go to the top right and click on the three dots and settings. Then click on link devices and click on link device and scan it. It will then say loading your chats and they'll be loaded. And I can then go and read them from this device. As I said, on an Android, you can click on the three dots and you can then switch between your accounts. 